Okay, so um, let's learn about um, another block today called uh, turn your sprite counterclockwise uh, to the specified degree. So in the last tutorial we looked at another uh, the, the, the first version which is a clockwise direction uh, and now this is a counterclockwise which is that means the opposite of the uh, the clockwise direction. Uh, this particular block falls under the category called motion okay and at the same time uh, this block is of type called stack okay the stack means you can put uh, one block on a top of this and the other block on the bottom of this so you can stack one block on a top of another block okay so uh, let's look at this another uh, the, the circle so let's see as you as I said before that by default if you have a sprite on this uh, if you have a sprite on this uh, stage uh, by default when you use a move block it will move in a direction of 90 degree right now we saw on a, uh, uh, a previous uh, tutorial that every circle has total of 360 degree okay so this one is opposite of the clockwise direction that means let's say if you enter if you enter positive value let's say if you enter 20 positive 20 is going to go on into the uh, into the counterclockwise direction right so if you enter 20 is going to go this direction right so that means the now the the, the sprite will point toward 70 degree because because it's it's uh, it's uh, it's the counterclockwise direction, right? And if you enter the negative twenty, is going to go opposite. That means okay. So let's see. This is like plus twenty, and if now my negative twenty will go into this direction, okay? Which is uh, it will point to hundred and ten, okay? So this is how this uh, block works. Um, it is completely opposite a clockwise direction, which is counterclockwise. Okay, so you can use either one of them, and uh, you can replace one with another. Uh, just make sure that you put the right value, either positive or negative. Okay, so let's jump into the practical, so you understand the little bit of detail. Okay. Uh, so let's uh, see you in a uh, um, practical and thanks for watching okay so uh, welcome to the uh, practical and uh, let's uh, create a default project and when you do that you will have a default scratch cat and make sure if you are if you have a multiple uh, sprite in uh, sprite area you always first select your sprite okay and when you select it now you can work on the script area okay okay so let's drag this turn counterclockwise uh, degree uh, block okay so as we um, looked at on in the brainstorming uh, section that when you uh, this is totally opposite of the clockwise uh, uh, right so this is a clockwise this is counterclockwise so in the last practical we saw the clockwise this is the counterclockwise so you can uh, so counterclockwise if you enter the positive value right so if I enter 20 and double click this uh, block it's going to the positive value but this is a remember this is a counterclockwise block so it's going to go if you enter positive it's going to go to on the top right it's going to turn it's going to turn into this direction right now I'm going to reset back by double clicking this point to in a direction 90 that's something we're going to look at in the next video okay so if I enter the negative value now and double click this guy it's going to go opposite right so positive is this direction negative is opposite right so it's going to point to 110 degree okay so this is how this uh, uh, works now uh, you can replace one block with another one and uh, just make sure that you enter the uh, proper uh, 
value with either positive or negative based on your requirement of the project okay so yeah play around uh, uh, with this blocks and uh, we will see you in the next video and thanks for watching